Morning. Mother, I hope you're well. I love you. Today is Wednesday, July the 10th. I've got probably 13 or 14 yards to mow. And the other day, I went and was going to get six chicks at Rule King, and a person offered me a deal a dollar a piece if I take all of them. So I wound up with 12, and I said I wasn't going to get 12 no more because I got plenty of chickens and chicks. But what are you going to do? I couldn't resist. And Mariah reminded me last night that she's going to go head up to New York next week. And then at the same time, James is taking his vacation. So uh, Sylvie, or uh, Jeremy, which is my middle daughter's boyfriend, I don't know, slash husband, people don't get married no more. It's confusing. You want to say husband, but he's not the husband. There's no legal thing there. So I guess, the, I guess just everybody does boyfriends and girlfriends anymore. There's, I don't know how that works out when you retire and all. Because I know that if you're married, a woman can get her husband's... She can choose between getting her husband's Social Security or hers... Whichever one's greater, which is very handy because a lot of times back in my day, um, a parent, one of the parents stayed home and took care of the children. Of course, is starting about 20 years ago, that wasn't hardly possible anymore because people didn't make that kind of money, and it's taken. It takes everything that both people can make in order to make it financially. So my daughter, Erin, she has five children. It'd definitely be more cost-effective for one of them to stay home and take care of the children. So, you know, uh, well, what are you going to do? It's all messed up. But anyway, Jeremy's going to help me mow next week. I don't know how he is. Uh, I don't know how much experience he has. He seems like a good worker. Uh, we put him to uh, to do some some jobs, and he does quite well. Um, so we'll just see how that works today. Well, yesterday it got about 95-ish, I guess, with the heat index, maybe a little bit more. And today it's due to get about be about 100. Now, it is, the cool thing about this, and I'm not really complaining, because, I mean, my work load is affected by the weather, and right now the weather is perfect for growing. It's very, very hot, and we're getting a lot of moisture, a lot of rain, and it's supposed to rain again today, so I love it. Um, not complaining here. It makes it a little bit difficult sometimes to get to everything and keep up, but, you know, I thank God for the work, and, you know, uh, plenty of work to help other people out, too. It's really good. Um, I'm really grateful for my family, all of my family. Uh, I'm a very blessed person. I have a very large family. Uh, my mother, she's 82, be 83 this this August she's still alive uh, and then like I've always said about my mother if there's ever an angel on earth it's my mother so um, I just wanted to catch up on my day's day uh, my, the day's events so you guys um, you take care and, uh, you know, I enjoy uh, everybody to respond and make comments. I wish my relatives would get into that more because that's mainly what these videos are for. 
to keep up with my relatives, the ones in Clintwood, Virginia, the ones in Richmond, Virginia, and the ones local. Uh, I have relatives everywhere, Texas, I guess everyone does anymore. So I wish they would tune in more, and it would be a good way to comment. If you comment in the videos, then all the family gets to, to see what's going on. And I, I'm, I'm more into the YouTube than I am to the Facebook. So, um, you guys, have a beautiful day. One of them cats are fighting like animals. Why y'all got to fight like that? Anyways, have a beautiful day, and I'll see you. Well, guess I won't see you. Maybe you'll see me tomorrow. Bye. So, Mother, I want to be up there. I'm hoping to get up there maybe next week or two after Mariah gets back from her vacation. I hope. But if not, remember I love you and I'm thinking about you always. Bye-bye.